Hey guys, what's going on? This is Squirrely here, and just to give you guys a quick update, because some people have been asking me what's going on with the videos and where have you been, uh, uh, basically I finished my master's degree a couple months ago, and I've just been job hunting and interviewing like crazy, but luckily uh, I found a good job and I found a new place, so hopefully I'm in the process of moving right now, uh, but hopefully things will be back on track soon, so not to worry. Anyways, there's a lot of cool stuff going on in TF2. There's a lot of things coming up. Uh, one of the coolest things, obviously, is Halloween update, which is coming. And this is super interesting because Valve has told us, they actually told us what's going on. Uh, so props to Valve for being transparent. This is really cool for us to see what they're working on. But basically, they said they're not working on TF2 Halloween update themselves. It's going to be all community-based, which is, I think, in general is good uh, because some of the ones that Valve, you know, controlled were kind of a letdown. Um, there's usually just a couple parts of the Halloween updates that kind of carried the whole thing. Uh, but anyways, this year is all community-based, so there's a ton of good artists and people who submit content every year so there's going to be you know no shortage of awesome stuff to, to uh, select from uh... valve also said basically they want to take manpower mode out of beta soon and also they're focusing on matchmaking which is awesome so props to valve for letting us know what's going on and um, just being very transparent with everything but anyways when i start talking about stuff in the halloween update and things i've seen and things i'm excited for uh, you know, people are asking, like, what are you talking about? Where do you see this? I want to see what you're talking about. So basically, if you want to get a sneak peek of what could be in the Halloween update, all you have to do is go to the Steam Community Workshop. That's all you got to do. Uh, so if you scroll down here to the right, you'll see Halloween. Check that to filter everything. Uh, and then everything is basically being submitted daily. Like, these are things that people just posted. Uh, you can filter by most recent. Uh, I have it on most recent popular um, and basically people were just submitting stuff non-stop like so yesterday these weren't even on here when I checked and they have I mean all kinds of crazy stuff we have spies with skull faces we have a hippie soldier which I think this set's gonna be really cool uh, especially you know soldiers like to paint their outfits and everything uh, we have uh, weapons with new skins kinda spooky sp uh, spooky themed skins we have people submitting unusual effects uh, and just all kinds of crazy stuff you can filter it uh, down more to per class or headgear or whatever you want uh, but there's just constant submissions on here you can see there's 31 pages of Halloween stuff some of it is old and unused from years before but there's a lot of new stuff going up uh, so hopefully Valve I'm guessing they're gonna kinda push back the update because um, I think last year was kinda early usually it's like a week or week and a half before Halloween uh, I'm guessing they might kinda push it back that way people have more time to submit stuff uh, which is a good thing but who knows, maybe they get enough good stuff early on they can release it uh, on time. There's also unusual effects on the market, as you can see. Uh, if you go down here and you can filter it by unusual effect, these are all the new unusual effects people are submitting. Uh, and most of them, I mean, they look kind of cool just to the normal person. Uh, but if you've been around unusuals a long time, you'll notice that a lot of them are just old effects that they just change the tint or the color or they mix them together. So there's a lot of them that are like, green black hole with like one other effect thrown in there so they're basically old effects that people are just kind of mixing and matching like smoking with kilowatt with miami lights you know just kind of like throwing in stuff but anyways there's two i wanted to show you uh one of them which is basically sunbeams with the new color on it but it looks pretty cool uh but this one here eerie flames this one is actually a new submission uh you can see here on the right it was submitted just a, just a day or so ago um but if you actually look at the original, this is the original Eerie Flame submission. This has been on here forever. Uh, 2011, or excuse me, 2012, this was submitted, and people have been hyped and wanting this for the longest time. So this is pretty much probably the best chance we're going to have to get this. Uh, now, the thing that's probably not good for it is there's already two other flames. Uh, so do they want to release another flames, which would automatically be god tier, you know, and it'll compete a lot with other ones uh, or maybe they don't care but the good news is that if Valve is sticking to their word and every single thing released taunts and cosmetics and unusuals and everything is going to be communities uh, based on community submissions then this has a really good chance so as of right now the Eerie Flames one is probably the most hyped uh, the most anticipated definitely the most popular effect that people have been wanting for years 
Uh, so this is pretty much our best chance to get one. And for me especially, I collect Exquisite Racks. It's a uh, Misk for Soldier. I have a Burning one and a Scorching one. And if I could add this there, oh man, I would be in heaven. I could just retire. I would be done. I wouldn't. Ha I wouldn't care anymore. Um, I'm hoping that they he makes it brighter or something like. So that basically you can see it like scorching and burning, uh, because some of the effects like searing, uh, eerie fire, and some of the other ones like you can't really see them if there's any light, which is kind of a bummer because they're cool effects. So hopefully this one is bright and uh, shines out more like the other burning and, and uh, scorching. But anyways, there you guys have it. Uh, if you want to take a look at everything that could possibly be in the new TF2 Halloween update, just check the workshop. People are submitting stuff like crazy. Uh, you can help vote up on some, you can share them, you can leave comments and kind of help uh, promote and share this stuff. Um, so it's really cool, it's going to be exciting. I'm interested to see what Valve selects. They have a ton of good stuff to choose from, so we really have to just kind of wait and see. But alright, that'll do it for me. Thanks a lot. This has been Squirrely. I appreciate you guys' views and love, and I will see you guys next time.